So it is December and I have just arrived on my holiday to Appledore in Devon. I arrived about one o'clock I think and then I walked towards Westwood Ho Beach. Didn't get that all the way there because I was a bit worried about it getting dark. But Appledore is really lovely. I haven't been here before but there's lots of little shops and galleries and pubs. Um, so I'm looking forward to exploring it for the next six days and I'm going to make hopefully a lot of artwork while I'm here. I'm feeling very windswept after my walk to Westwood Ho. Um, Winnie is walking around like, this is where we live now and where is Sam? Uh, because my husband Sam isn't here. He always comes on holiday with us. He always books the holiday. He always drives. Um, but he doesn't have any holiday days left. So we're here on our own. <laughs> Winnie's just exploring. Um, so it feels really weird and quite brave because I am an anxious person and holidaying on my own just isn't something. No, Winnie. Winnie, off. Good girl. You're not allowed on the sofa here. It's not our house. I know you don't understand, do you? Um, look, go to your bed. Go to your bed. Go to your bed. Good girl. Um, she's just going to be one. Okay. Do you want to come up here? Go on in. Um, anyway. Um, yeah, I want this to be like a self-directed residency, I guess. Um, I knew I'd have a bit of a quieter time after all the advent calendars that I made. Um, we'll post it out. So this is kind of early to mid-December right now. Are you, you don't want to be up here? Fine. Um, so yeah, I bought um, three wood blocks. Winnie. <laughs> what are you doing? Um, three wood blocks. She's chasing her tail now. What, what, what do you want from me? Just wait there. Um, some collaging stuff and um the i write some winnie can you not though um i've been writing a, a bit of i'm just gonna ignore her i've been writing a bit of poetry in the last year so i bought my book that i've been writing that in and to continue that is that something i want to think about next year like an um illustrated poetry book um so yeah that's the plan. I've got six days, five full days. Um, so I guess that's seven days. I'm arriving on the Sunday, living on the Saturday. Um, so yeah, this is a little two bed cottage on a little uh, narrow street of Appledore. It's really lovely. I'll show you around probably tomorrow when I put everything away. Um, but now I'm going to have some cookies that my sister made, a cup of tea and unpack. It's my first morning here in Appledore and um, I've come to towards Westwood Ho again because um, where I was yesterday on my walk I found a good spot where you can park up and um, I thought I can print for my car which I haven't done before actually but as it's windy um, and December I figured um, that's probably sensible. I'm just going to walk Winnie to Westwood Ho Beach first so that she will sleep in the car while I probably spent about four hours um, engraving and printing. So yeah, it is beautiful here. We're now on Westwood Ho Beach and Winnie is having the best time. Um, I don't think she's been to the beach in ages because we live in the Cotswolds, so there's not many, well, there's not any beaches that are really near. Um, so she, yeah, she is having the best day, hoping to tire her out and then she won't bother me. And then the sea, that's the estuary there, I think. The, is it? Yeah, I think, I don't know. And then the sea is not, like, it's all the way out there. That is madness. Come here. It's 
the end of the first full day of my holiday slash residency and yeah it was good I was printing for so long today I don't know exactly how long I need to look at the timestamp on the videos but I think it was about five hours I have made a video that will go up after this one I think about that so I made a three colour reduction print I know you're not watching me for you know the geographical information but so I now know that the bit of land between Appledore and Westwood Ho I believe was called the Northern Burrows Country Park so it's like um, I think there's a golf course there as well there were like horses and sheep there's a lot going on but it's really beautiful um, and then the beach I was on this morning I started on Grey Sands Beach and then I, walk, I kept walking and I think it turned into Westford Ho Beach. The tide was so far out that I think they kind of were one beach. Um, so yeah, I got quite a lot done today, but I decided it was getting a bit dark and the ink was quite wet to be adding another layer to it. So the prints are hanging up above the fire now and I will finish printing them later in the week. So yeah. Um, Tomorrow, I'm thinking, I'm not sure what I'm going to do, whether I'm going to stay around here in Appledore or if I'm going to go to Instow, which is across the estuary. Um, I need to have a little think about what art I'm going to make tomorrow. I forgot to do a video this morning while it was daylight of the house, but I filmed a few clips to show you now. So it's a really sweet two bedroom cottage um on a really narrow street uh, i think you can get a car up it but i didn't want to try it's really cozy i've lit the fire and yeah one of the bedrooms i'm using and one of the bedrooms i'm using to dry some prints in because i want to collage with them and they're not yet dry but yeah it's kind of perfect um it's a nice little base to have for the week and i think i paid 387 including a non-refundable like damages deposit and then winnie i think maybe it was like 20 pounds for winnie for the week or something like that um so i didn't want to go above 400 because it's just me and you know it's work rather than a holiday so yeah a really lovely place to be <laughs> second full day of my holiday um, and I've just come back to the beach uh, to give Winnie a walk because it's going to rain like for a lot of today so I've got up quite early um, so I'm going to give her a walk and then I might head to Biddeford um, I'm not really sure what I'm doing today I have brought along um, some drawing materials and a tiny little sketchbook uh, that my friend Todd Patterson made me um, so I thought maybe I could try and fill that today so there are quite a lot of pages even though it is tiny so that might be what I do but yeah I'm gonna be a bit limited because um, the rain Winnie and I are just sat on the sofa after the second full day of this uh, residency slash holiday I'm still confused as to what it is I don't feel like I did much today in terms of art and then now I feel like oh, I'm a bit stressed about that and I just thought I'd do I would have done more on this trip um but anyway the book is full so that's good I've made like a uh a YouTube short um that I'll have put up by the time you're watching this that you can go and see about that but yeah there's just um a few I don't know how many paintings there are on there, like watercolour slash sketches. So this morning after my walk, I went to Biddeford and went to the art gallery there, the Burton in Biddeford, which was really lovely. I just went in the shop though because I had Winnie um, and obviously dogs aren't allowed in the gallery areas. But they have a Louise Bourgeois exhibition on, which I would have really liked to see. So I might head back there later in the week if I feel like I've got time to do that. Then I came back to Appledore. What did I do next? I think me and Winnie walked around for a bit. Yeah, we walked around for a bit. And then I decided to leave Winnie at my house and just visit a few of the shops here. 
the shops are very sweet there's some little gift shops there's um an antique shop and a bookshop as well i spent quite a lot of time in that bookshop actually and i bought um a thomas buick book i have one similar but i think i've got another volume of it so yeah that was a nice find that's it really um i might do a bit of collage tonight if i uh find the motivation i <laughs> I don't know. I just I just thought I'd be doing more than I am. Maybe because I'm away from home, my my brain is saying. But you're on holiday. You should be resting. Um. So yeah. Anyway, tomorrow I think my parents are gonna visit. So I don't know if I'll get any art done tomorrow. So anyway, that's what I've been up to today. It's Wednesday morning, and I have come back to Grey Sands Beach because. Oh, it's just like Grey Sands and Westwood Ho Beach are like some of the best beaches I have ever been to in terms of like, well, I guess because it's December, they're really quiet, they're big, they're sandy, Winnie loves them. So I just thought it's like criminal to be a few minutes drive and not visit every day. So I don't know when my parents are arriving, but I think I have a bit of time. So I, I've got a wood block. And I thought I'd like to try engraving again, but with just, possibly, with just the square scooper this time. And it's meant to be sunny today, so I was like, oh, this will be lovely watching the sunrise. But it is so cold and windy. I think there's like gusts of like 30 mile an hour. So it's going to be a windy old time. I'm going to see if I can still do it. Um, but yeah, that's what I'm up to right now. Rather than going for a spot that I choose for the view, I've ended up with a similar view to the last print I did because um, I've just had to find someone that's more sheltered, so I'm kind of sheltering behind these dunes. Um, I've put a coat on Winnie because it is cold, and if I'm going to be sat here for a while, she might get a bit chilly. I'm going to film a short, like a YouTube short, but I'm not going to film like a full on video for this because I'm a bit low on time today. I've finished the block now. Um, I did it quite quickly because I'm so cold. Winnie is cold. The sun is just coming out, so that's not great timing. Um, it's very like a wood cut rather than a wood engraving or like a lino print, very bold, which isn't as surprising as I use the boldest tool I have with me. But um, I was thinking as I was making it, maybe if I get a second block and print the color on the second block and print this over the top, that might make quite a nice effect um so i might try that but it was interesting uh yeah interesting is the word i'd use i don't love it but you know as i said if i use another block that might improve things it's about half seven in the evening and my parents have just left we've had a nice day we went back to the beach because I love the beach and um yeah we walked from Appledore to Grey Sands and had lunch and then yeah wandered around the shops in Appledore and had dinner and then went and looked at Appledore at night because um there's a lot of Christmas lights so that was really nice I think it was nice to have a bit of company today because obviously I'm here on my own with Winnie, of course. But um, yeah, it's Wednesday, so I'm halfway through the holiday and it was nice to have like a day of socialising. Um, I haven't really felt lonely, to be honest. I did a bit on m Monday night, yeah. But actually, I thought it would feel really weird being on my own for so, like for so much of the time, seeing as I normally i am used to living with someone. But actually, I've been totally fine and it does just solidify the fact I really am an introvert. Um, so yeah, two more days left, two more full days left of the holiday, slash residency. Um, so yeah, I've got, you know, lots more exploring to do. It's Thursday morning and I've come to Insta to do some collaging to finish off the video that will already be up now. It'll be the last video I uploaded about making collage materials and then yeah doing some collaging while I'm away so I've just finished that 
which was nice. It was quite busy, so I came along to the end of the beach. Because Winnie is totally friendly with dogs. Unless I sit down anywhere and then she decides we own that spot. So yeah, I had to find somewhere a little bit um, quieter. Yeah, I'm not really sure what I'm doing today because, um, I don't know, I just feel a bit like I don't really know what to do. But um, Insta is lovely, so it's opposite uh, Appledore, so the estuary is between the two. And I think in the summer months you can get a ferry, which would be lovely, but I guess it's not economical to have the ferry running all year. So um, yeah, I drove around. So I might head back to Appledore now and grab a bit of lunch. I think that might be my plan. I feel pleased with myself today because I finally got my Christmas cards done and posted. So that is done. And then I dragged Winnie out from under her cosy fleece. We came back to the northern burrows again because I just love it here. I've been doing a bit of beach combing and a bit of beach cleaning. And yeah, I think we're going to head back to the cottage now, have some dinner and relax and possibly do some collaging and definitely some editing. It is the last day of the holiday and I am so sad to be going. Um, this morning I met up with Claire Wilcox, who is a, an artist, a painter, uh, mainly doing oil and watercolour and we walked along the beach and we went to the cafe and she painted and I collaged and it was lovely. It was like the highlight of my trip I think, it was just nice to sit there and have a chat with another artist. We had never met before actually, um, but we did go to the same school, she was just a few years above me. But that was really lovely and then from there I went back to Biddeford because I thought I can't be this near a Louise Bourgeois exhibition and not go and see it because I studied her work when I was at uni. So I went around that really quickly because Winnie was in the car and then headed back to Appledore, had a last look around the shops, did a collage at the cottage and now I'm back at the beach. I thought I'd end the video here on the beach because I mean it's featured pretty heavily in this video. Uh, Winnie's face was slightly covered in sand because she was just playing with a whippet. So yeah, I'll end the video here. Thanks for watching if you've got this far. Um, I've really enjoyed my residency. I haven't got as much work done as I thought, but then I think that's because every day I've spent about an hour and a half editing YouTube videos. And that's time normally on a holiday I'd probably spend collaging. So that's probably why it feels like I haven't done as much because editing time but um yeah I've loved it I love Appledore I love Grey Sands Beach and yeah it's just been really lovely I have I thought I was going to feel lonely and that it would feel really intense but the days have felt so busy I haven't felt that lonely like I have at points but not really that badly I had one evening where I felt anxious well, I'm not anxious all the time, but one evening where I, you know, my, my insomnia got the better of me. I couldn't sleep for ages. But, yeah, it's just been a really lovely experience. And also I'm proud of myself because I rely on my husband so heavily to, like, drive everywhere, organise everything, plan our days. And I've done it all on my own. Um, and I think it shows that you can do things if you need to. Um, and it's probably healthy to be a bit more independent and like next time we go away together maybe I can do some of the driving um, that's like one of the biggest anxieties is driving because I struggle quite a lot with anxiety around driving and especially places I haven't been before but yeah I've managed it um, so yeah I really look forward to doing more trips like this let me know if you have any suggestions of where I should go. My car only has like 110 miles range because it's electric. It's one of the older electrics. So I'm slightly limited as to how far I can go from South Gloucestershire because I don't want to be, you know, spending all day getting somewhere because I have to keep stopping to charge. Um, and the next uh, residency I'm doing, the only other one I've got planned is um, in Wales, 
uh, next month, so January, February, for two weeks. Um, so I'll talk more about that and I'll do a video while I'm there as well. I've also really loved just spending time with Winnie, like, I feel lucky to have her and to be able to spend so much time with her. And, um, yeah, we've had, we've had a nice week, haven't we, Winnie? She is covered in sand. So that's it. Uh, the video about the first day of my holiday is coming out soon. Um, the three colour reduction print I did here. And after that, I'm not really sure. But um, thanks for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe, click the notification bell, and also please like it. If you spent time watching it, please like it. Just so, um, because I'm new on here and it really helped. I'm aware that the audio wasn't great for this video and like there's like um, wind in the audio. Um, I will look at getting a, a microphone for future videos, but I'm just, yeah, not sure. I want to make the investment just yet. So thanks for bearing with and yeah, thanks for watching. Thank you.